Hello everyone, I'm back, Lucha FM, with another episode, and where you left us off last, we basically went on a bit of a decent run. We won three games and drew one, and I feel like we're a bit unlucky not to win that game that we drew, but we're still playing really well. We're currently third after eight games played. Um, we're going on it. We're doing a. We're doing well. Um, but like I said, I'm not saying I'm not getting too confident because we do go on a bit of a bad run as the season goes on. So we'll just have to see how it goes. Hopefully that's not the case and we can crack on. Um, but I'll be back in a sec with the first game of the episode. Right, so the first game of the episode, we are playing Brest. Um, keep your jokes to yourself about that one. Um, but yeah, we're playing them. Not an easy team to beat, but hopefully it's a, it's definitely a winnable game for us. Um, Vaz is up front. Kofi's on the right wing, so the assistant manager has decided to put Kofi back on the right wing for whatever reason, but we'll trust his judgment. LeBron is in central defence in this game. Pinto is on the right, uh, moving in the middle of midfield. Um, and Vaz up front, so let's just see how we get on. Hopefully Vaz has had a bit of a rest, so he will come in firing on all cylinders. We'll see. Brest aren't doing very well this season. They're currently 14. Nine games played, they've got eight points. No highlight. Uh, first highlight of the game goes to us. Angeli with a beautiful free kick. He's pretty good at free kicks. Let's have a look. Is he? Is he good? Is he good at set pieces? Free kick taking ten. Ah, okay. Well, not as good as I thought it was, but not too bad. I thought maybe we unearthed the French version of Wolf Prowse or something. Uh, only highlight of the game so far. A bit of a boring one. Highlights of rest. Nice bit of passing by them. Let's hope we can close him down. We don't, but he misses it, luckily. Did up not playing very well. Diagne's not playing very well. The rest of the team aren't too bad at the moment. Quiet first half. Let's hope the second half's a bit more action packed. We've had a few bookings, so we need to. Uh, probably need to sub a few players actually to be honest we'll take him off um, we'll leave it as that actually for now because we don't want to take too many players off too early right I think Brest are going to score in a sec oh good save Mwemba with the ball passes it across to Bastion Bastion on the left wing keeps going gets the crossing headed over by Kofi unfortunately Try encouraging the players, hopefully that'll help. Oh no. Kofi, what are you doing all the way back there? You you clearly can't tackle. Right, let's see what BL says. I think it is a penalty though, it looks very clear. Yeah. Bloody hell, Kofi. Ah, right, he chan with the penalty. Is he gonna score? He does. One nil. Not the best start to the episode. Still got plenty of time though. Right, I'll berate the players, see if that will help. Hopefully it will. Uh, right, need to take some more players off. Yeah, need to come on. We'll put in Matthias. Uh, Thierry can come off. We'll put on Andu. And then we'll take off Angeli. And we'll put on Muller. Hopefully the fresh legs will help. Bobby Abdu is a very good player. Kofi's knackered, so we'll take him off. On him. Money. Right, hopefully the subs can make a difference in this game. Money, unfortunately, headed out. Pinto, though, passes it inside. Little one two there. Bastian, go on. Yes, go on, Bastian. You can always guarantee on him. Being the hero, getting us back in the game. 1-1. One, one. Now what do we do now? Do we push on and try and get a win? Or do we just uh, just concentrate and try and see this game out? By the looks of it, we're going to go for another, another chance here. That was a poor pass if I've ever seen one. Still got the ball. Matthias gives it to Pinto. 
Pinto with first time cross. Oh, that was unlucky by Bass. Right, corner. Probably the last highlight of the game to us. Pinto with the corner. I think this one's going to go straight to the goalkeeper's hands, but we'll see. Taking his sweet time. Come on. Is the game froze? I don't really. Head it out. Yeah, I think it's going to end 2-2 two, two here. 1-1, one, one, sorry. Not 2-2, two, 1-1. Two, one, one. Not the best result, but at least we didn't lose. We're still third, so at least there's that. We're playing second place next game, so big, big game. Biggest game of the season so far for us coming up. Right, we're back in a sec with the next game. Right, we've got Lens now. Biggest game of the season so far. Azanga's on the right, Kofi's up front. So maybe our assistant manager has decided to... Um, he prefers Kofi up front now instead of on the right wing. Uh, the Agni's playing right back today. Lebrun is centre-back partnership with Paisley. And then we've got Matthias, who doesn't usually play, in for Bastion, which is a shame. We really could have done with Bastion, but he's, obviously, he's injured. Thierry and Abdul midfield, and then, like I said, Isanga on the right, Angeli in the middle, Dinner on the left, and Kofi up front. And obviously, Papal, as always, in goal. Yeah, yeah this will be a very stern test. Oh, Nisa second now, but it's still a big game, playing third. We we win this one, we're maybe second, we'll, probably, we'll definitely be third if we beat Lens. Let's see how it goes. Nothing so far after 20 minutes, no highlights. Lens look like the better team though, looking at the stats, but that don't always guarantee that they will win. This is a very, there we go, finally a highlight. Once it's gone to Lens. Pop out with the save, I think. Oh no, headed over. Right, we've got a highlight hopefully in our favour. Matthias loses the ball. He is playing rubbish. Uh, I, can't, I can't shout at you at the moment, I will in a minute. Lens very unlucky not to score there. Luckily it went out of play. Right, can I give you a no I can't. I'll give him a talent off in the second half. Him and Didot are not playing. Oh, and Bobby Abdu. Some very poor performances so far. Abdu. Maybe he'll redeem himself here, setting up this goal. Oh, Kofi with the first time shot. Right, let's try and demand a bit more of the players. We'll be making some early substitutions in a minute. I'm going to wait until the 60th minute. Let's see what this highlight does first. Paisley. Nice bit of passing here. Matthews, we're starting to get into the game a bit now, I think. Matthews is not very good, though. He's still got the ball, though. Oh, get in. Always forgiving, Matthews. 1-0. Nice partnership. Uh, nice um, assist by the left-back to the right-back to score. 1-0. Our forward players need to come off, though, because they're not playing very well. So Didot will come off. And we'll put on... You and then you can come off and we'll put on you. Uh, Isanga can come off, we'll put on you. Right, let's see how that happens. How that, how that, oh, I forgot about Bobby Abu. There we go. Right, I think we've put on all of our substitutes now. I don't think we can take anybody else off. So I might have been a bit hasty and never can. We can. Ah, oh, there we go. We'll have to take Diagni off. We've got Guerrero in. Oh no, sorry, Guerrero. One one balls. Again, a draw would probably be a decent result against Lens away. Even though I want to win more every game, but sometimes we have to be realistic. Right, corner headed in, unfortunately. Two one to Lens. Maybe that was a mistake by me taking all them players off. And settle the team a bit. Another highlight to Lin, uh, Lens. I love that Lens kit though. I love the colours. Always makes me think of McDonald's though, to be honest. That's probably why. Oh dear. Oh well. 3 1. At least we know where we stand this season. We weren't, we weren't aiming for 
title challenge, but you know, fourth place is not too shabby. Good save by Papa, confident save. Bit of consolation goal, hopefully. Papa kicks it out to Matthews. Matthews gives it to Thierry. Oh, Mugen loses the ball. And now we're exploited defensively here. Oh, that was unfortunate own goal. <laughs> you got to laugh, ain't you? That was quite funny. <laughs> right, Angeli with the free kick. Saved by the goalkeeper. Good free kick, to be honest. That would have been a great goal if it went in. Angeli not giving up just yet, even though there's only four minutes left. Corner. Headed out. Lens now on the counter attack. Yeah, they're they're a much better team than we are. Is that is that going to be allowed? VAR will have a say on it. Hopefully, it won't be allowed because it's embarrassing enough to lose four one. Yeah, thank you, referee and linesman. Right, end this game now, please. Four one. Right, uh, four one. Oh god, we're playing PSG next. Okay, right, we're back in the set with the next game. Right, we're back and we've got a big, big game now. Um, PSG, they're probably gonna absolutely thrash us. I'm quite scared right now. I mean, we lost four one to Lens, so God knows what PSG are gonna do. Um, and this, I, I think they've still got Mbappe at PSG because this isn't this isn't the re this, this save was started ages before Mbappe went to Real Madrid. So, yeah, not uh, not confident, but we'll see. Like I said, if I don't lose, I'll be a happy man. Um, I think we got Bastian back, so that's good. And then Abdou's back in the midfield. Azanga's on the right. Kofi's up front. Uh, probably our strongest team out, I think. Uh, hopefully that will help us in some way. We're down to fifth now because obviously Lil Lil's overtook us, and a lot of the teams have got games ahead of us as well. They got so that won't help. But you know, like I said, mid table. I'll be happy with mid table first season. They got Masala as well. Yeah, one nil already. Masiala, Masiala. Maybe they haven't got him back in. I don't see him. Let's have a look. Have a look at this PSG lineup. Right. Oh, they have got Mbappe. Great. They've got Muani, Mbappe, Musiala, Barella, Emery, Ugarte, Mendes. Literally every player who is an outstanding player. Antonio Silva, Hakimi, Don Rumor. They've got Jota on the bench, Ederson, uh, Alex McAllister, Vega, Yilmaz, Kanate, Reese, Nielsen. Yeah, we are screwed. Absolutely screwed, and we're only eight. We're only eight minutes in. We're already losing one nil. So that worries me. Back down to six. See, this is what worries me here. We start doing well, and then we'll, we'll have a dip of form, and we'll start trickling down the league. Zanga is not playing very well. Need to, need to take him off in the second half. Who else is not playing well? Zanga, Didop's not playing particularly well. Kofi, Paisley. Good cross, but oh, I thought that was going to be a goal there. Pinto. Yes, go on, Kofi. No VAR interference as well. Get in. Amazingly, we've equalised. Which is highly, which I would never expect. But yeah, one one. Cannot complain. I'm happy with that so far. Isango is coming off. We've got November on. Pinto with the throw in. November passes it across to Paisley. Bastin gives it to Angeli. Oh, Angeli with a swerving shot. Good save by Donnarumma to say uh, to stop him from scoring. Pinto with the corner. 
rock sitter. If you can hear a buzzing noise, I can only apologise. There is a fly now who entered the kitchen. And hopefully you can't hear all that buzzing. Drives me up the wall. Right, we've uh, after we've conceded we're actually being the better team by the looks of it. Last him with the ball. Get away, go on, get out of here. Bloody fly. Passes it back to Popal. Popal across to Pinto. Nice pass by the goalie. Pinto, who's been playing really well so far. Unfortunately, first of the commentator there. Still retain possession though, did I? Takes it onto the left wing. Passes it, unfortunately defended well. Got it back, Pinto, who assisted. Get in, go on! Right, we are winning 2-1 against PSG. Um, I don't know how or why, but we are. I'm not complaining. I know it's probably not going to happen, but the fact that we're leading against these with 20 minutes to go is quite exciting. Didot needs to come off. Um, we'll put Monin in and we'll swap him over in a minute. We'll take off Paisley. He's not doing very well. Right, I'll leave us that because last time I made those substitutions, I completely messed it up. Um, right, so we need to put swap them across. Like so there we go. Right, let's see how we get on. Thierry actually needs to come off because he's knackered. And Gary needs to come off because he's knackered. Okay, two two enforced substitutes. We're still winning. Famous last words, I know. Ooh, this is getting more exciting. Six minutes. Come on, hold out for the win here. Come on, lads. That was a poor throw in. They're going to score now, aren't they? Oh, this makes me sad. Donnarama. I feel like they're just going to pass it from the fence here and then they're going to score and it's going to be one of the rubbish oh no, we got it back oh, Muller with plenty of space get in, go on get in 3-1 absolute shock win here I would never ever expect us to beat PSG we have completely destroyed them what a win I would say that's probably the greatest victory in Socho's career so far on this game with me. Um, absolute outstanding win. And we'll be back in a second with the next game of the episode. Right, so we've got um, Reims next away. Um, pretty much the same team as last game, I think, as far as I can see. Uh, let's just crack on, see how we get on. Um, I still can't believe we beat PSG 3-1. Unbelievable. Annoyingly though, we're still sixth. But if we win this game, we could be up to third, maybe, depending on how the other teams do. Angeli, across to Didot. Didot lives the ball, Bastian's got it back. Angeli, I knew as soon as he had that ball, he was going to score, get in. 1-0. Super Angeli. Luke Angeli, remember that name? I bet his value's gone up. Yeah, 12 to 19 million now. It'll go up again, I reckon, after this game. He is our prized asset. I hopefully never want to, s I don't want to sell any of my players to any French teams because it'll just strengthen them. Um, I'm hoping if I ever have to sell Angeli or, God forbid, Kofi, um, Bastian, etc. That they go to a team abroad because it will break my heart if we lose our, my favourite players in the club to PSG and then strengthen them and make them the better team but yeah we'll see right corner to Reims headed out nicely Didot will get the ball now we break from the counter attack Izanga Cross to Bastian. Bastian, who knows how to pass the ball, unfortunately didn't go to anybody. Azana gets it back though. Pinto, 1 2. 
Beautiful passing going on here. Unfortunately, we lose the ball though. Do we get it back? We do. Retain possession. I'll do. Thierry across to Bastian. Did I? Oh, great pass. Great finish. I think he was offside. Let's see what the VAR says. I think he was slightly ahead of the defender. Yeah. I'm getting better at this. I'm getting better at this. Um, oh yeah, just to update you by the way, I will start. I will start going to um, Cadbury Athletic Games starting. Um, starting the, I think it's the sixth of September or something like that. So not long now. The first month of the season, they can't play their games at home because uh, the cricket season's happening, and the, the and it's most it's more a cricket ground than it is a football ground. So Cadbury Athletic have to play the first four games of the season away. Um, but yeah, I'll be watching, I'll be going to see them on a Saturday st uh, starting soon. It's a beautiful ground as well. I went past it again the other day. I just was, I'm just looking forward to sitting there. Not so much in the winter months or when it's absolutely hammering it down, but it does look like a very nice place to sit and watch football. 1-1, one, one. Um, let's see what, okay, so Izanga needs to come off, and we'll put on Valmy, Both needs to come off, we'll put on Luemba, Abdu can come off, we'll put on Mugin, uh, and I think I'll leave it as that for now. Bruce the players, let's see if the, let's see if the substitutes can make a difference in this game. Throw in, Pinto to Angeli, Angeli gets it back, floats it up, great goal, Didot, go on, ah, again, I think he was slightly ahead of the defender there, but we'll see, oh no, I'll stand corrected, 2-1 to us, Reams, oh, I was going to say Reams coming back here, Didot, Paisley, Lubra over the top to Pinto. Yes, go on, Angeli. Fifth goal of the season for him. Game over as far as I'm concerned. 3 1. Great performance, right? Bastian, you can come off because you're all knackered. Uh, we'll just have to put you on. And then we'll take off Angeli. We don't want him being too tired. Right, I think that's all our subs used. Yeah. Okay, right. Let's just see this game up now. We're up to fourth now, which is good. We're one point behind Lens. Pop out with the save from the corner. Confident save by him. Boots it out. Headed nicely by Valmy. Pinto. Pinto manages to get past the defence. Valmy with the first time shot. Unlucky there. Do, 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 do. Right, I think this is going to end 3 1. Good result. We're doing really well this season. We're doing way better than I thought we were. Fourth. I will happily take fourth from the end of the season. We've got Strasbourg next, so I'll be off in a sec with the next game. Right, so we've got Strasbourg in the last game of the episode. Um, I think it's an unchanged team, unchanged team from last game. So let's crack on. Hopefully we can continue on our winning little winning streak. Uh, we're neck and neck on points with Marseille at the moment. We're one point behind Lens. So uh, if we win this, we'll hopefully leapfrog one of them. Be nice to end the episode with us. Oh, he's offside. That, I was going to say that won't count anyway. Um, yeah, it'd be nice to end this episode with a win. Leave us in like third or second place. Lens aren't winning though. So I think even if we win, I don't think we're getting second place today. But depending on our goal difference. 
we've still got to win this game as well. Strasbourg aren't aren't going to be an easy team for us to beat. They are backed by the same people who are Chelsea. So they probably spent a fair bit of money last year. Oh, lose the ball. I feel like this is going to lead to us scoring in a second. How do? Did I? Angeli. Oh, beautiful pass in here, Bastian. Oh, see, I told you. Oh, get in 1 0. Noisanga. Starting to do well on that right wing, Noisanga. I think Isang on the right and Kofi up front is probably the best combination. Vaz is decent, but I don't think he's good enough to be playing every game. He's a good substitute or a good backup, but I don't think he's strong enough up front to have Kofi on the right wing. So I do think this is our best combination here. Look at this beautiful passing exchanges here. Oh, that's unlucky by Bastian. Oh, 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 no. Do we get it back? We do. Isanga. Can this lead to a goal? Pinto. Over the top ball to Angeli. Angeli first time cross. Krufi. Oh, I thought that was in. Oof. Unlucky. Right, we're still winning 1 0 though. And do. Cross to Pinto. Gives it to Diagne, 1 2 back to Pinto. Oh, look at that. Beautiful, beautiful passing going on there. 2 0. Doing well. Cannot complain with this performance by our lads. One point behind Lenz. Popal with a goal kick. Passes it to Pinto. Thierry. Did not lose the ball. Diagne, oh, no, good tackle, Angeli, Kofi, across to Bastian, get in, go on, own goal I think, yep, we'll take it, I don't care, 3-0 at half time, good performance, Three nil, three nil, three nil, three nil. Can we add to the score? Because if it goes down to goal difference at the end of the season, we do need to get as many goals as possible. Oof. Angeli with the corner. Drives it in, headed out though. Pinto, I don't know what you were doing there, mate, but runs like runs it off for a opposition throw. Um I will be doing more I will be doing some mystery shirt content and play, uh fake football shirt content in September, in the next couple of weeks. Uh we'll be I will be doing putting in a few orders uh at the um when will I be doing it? First week of September I'll be putting the order in. So Fake shirts will take about 10, 10 to 14 days. So that'll be towards the end of September. But the mystery shirts will be the first first or second week of September. So some of them, uh, surprise shirts is really good. They sent, I ordered my shirt on Thursday and, I, and they sent it out the next day. And I think I got it on Saturday. So they're really good. Fortunately, I'm dog sitting for my mum in a couple of days time for a week. So I won't be doing the order then because I won't be there to receive it. So I'll order it when I come back. Did I? Oof, nearly. Yeah, 3-0. Happy days. I really do like how obscure surprise shirts go with their selections. They know what I like now. They know that I like bright colours with cool looking patterns, they don't care, they know I don't care about where the team is, um, I mean I wore a shirt on Saturday from a, a non-league Welsh team called the Doxton, um, just because I really liked their pattern on their shirt, I'm easily pleased, get in, 4-0, as, as, as long as it's not boring, 
um, and not white. I hate plain white. I know I'm wearing a white shirt today, um, but I I don't usually wear white because I tend to I tend to just get it stained and stuff. No, my look because I'm a messy eater at times, especially with chocolate. The chocolate, it don't matter what I do, chocolate specks of chocolate go everywhere on my shirts. Um, and chocolate is not the best to get out of white shirts, especially fake football shirts. Right. On that note, we're going to call it a day for this episode. Let's just have a quick look where we are. So we're going to be we're leaving this episode. Um, we are third, 13 games played, 8 wins, 2 draws and 3 losses, 26 points, 14 goal difference. So we have got a slightly better goal difference than wins. Um, next episode, we've got games against uh, Nantes, saint Etienne, Rungam, and Lille, so there'll be some tough games there, uh, and then maybe we'll play Nice if we've got time as well, so yeah, on that note, I'm going to call it a day, thank you as always for watching, um, if you haven't subscribed already, please subscribe, uh, like the video as well, that really goes a long way, and also just leave me a comment one way or another, whether you liked the episode or didn't, um, let me know who your favourite player is at Socio on this save, so far as well, is it Kofi, is it Bastian, is it Angeli, is it Isango, is it, I don't know, somebody that's now left, let me know, alright, have a nice day, I'll be back soon, all the best.